But we should probably go get Shade Cloak. I was hoping there would be a, uh... I was hoping there would be a, another... Uh, there'd be a, a stop. Let's see. A, uh... A stagway stop here. I think I might be under leveled for this section. I certainly don't feel like I'm doing as much damage as these guys have in health. So this might this might be death. Okay. Oh, ah. I gotta get used to the fact that I've got Dash Master on. Which I shouldn't have Dash Master on for this. It's probably not a good idea. There we go. Yeah, you can redirect those guys down into the spikes, which kills them. Which is really funny. Ow. Ow. Double out. Okay. Gotta get rid of you. There we go. Thank you, crits. You are lovely. Oh, right. You only get the Geo if you win. I forgot about that that deal. Which is like, it's a bit un unfortunate. I should be fine. And no, I'm not under level for this. Those snake guys just have a boatload of HP. Nope. Oh, that didn't work. <laughs> that works! I uh, don't know what his immediate plan was. I don't know. Oh, that's fine. Uh, these things. Yeah, this is where I first ran into these things, because I hadn't been down lower yet. Oh, it's okay. I mean, it is pretty much just a shooting gallery. Guess I probably shouldn't have bothered healing there until they were out of my hair. Oh, that's okay. We... Yep. Much easier with dashing. And enough room for it. Oh, right. Yeah, we're good. I remember these patterns. I remember these guys. Now, if I remember it, this does the really jerkish thing at some point of doing that, but with spikes. You are lies! Ugh. I remember being legit mad when that happened. I was like, oh, that's neat. You know, nice little, like, mid-run reward. And it was lies! Luckily, these guys are complete garbage against anti-air. Which is hilarious, because they are air. Just gonna use jumping attacks forever. It is the best. So what's the deal with the little caterpillars anyway? Uh, they're like, they're a, I mean, they're effectively a, a collectible. Uh, you find them all over the map, and by collecting them, uh, the grandpa caterpillar gives you, uh, oops. Yeah, here we go. The Grandpa Caterpillar gives you money and stuff. I don't think we have any safety platforms. No, we don't. This part's dangerous, because I can't heal. There we go. But yeah, so he's kind of... They're... they're 
appreciable little bonuses. Okay. There we go. Good time for healing. Uh, appreciable little bonuses with, like, extremely tangible benefits. Uh, that probably sounds kind of weird. Uh, but, you know, whenever you find them, they're, it's like a puzzle or a bunch of different things. I don't, I don't really know how to describe it, but it's just collect-a-thon fun. <sighs> right, these guys. Oh, I didn't even kill them. Uh, and if you get all of them, you get a, a charm, a really useful charm, actually. If I remember it, it's the charm that lets you shoot sword beams. Unless I'm mistaken. I don't think I am. Okay. Yeah, we got this. Slow. All right, well, that didn't work. Yeah, okay, so 46 caterpillars and sword beam. Thought so. Which is, it's not actually that amazing, uh, mainly because you can't take any damage. Uh, if, you, if you take damage, you lose your sword beams. There's a couple ways around that. Uh, the mod I installed, there's a uh, combo that actually makes it so you don't lose them. I'm just going to go full Rambo on that guy. Which pisses this one off. You can't touch me. Oh. Okay, fine. I just gotta kill it. Works. Your HP back. I need Quick Soul. We'll probably go visit Salubra after this. Is that it? We done? Oh, I forgot to turn off that uh, Geo combo. What? Well, whatever. So the fun part is we can actually redo this. Uh, we can redo these as desired. But yeah, it's basically Magic Sword from Legend of Zelda. Yep. Which is fun. I like it. Uh, but it does mean... Uh, there we go. Where's the Where's the other breakable wall? Oh, the breakable wall's up up above. Yeah, I forgot about this one. Where does this go? This feels new. What is this? So this is new from the Grim Troop. I don't think I ever made my way out here. <laughs> scared the shit out of me. Or maybe this is how you start Grim Troop. I don't really remember. Yeah. Good morning, anybody that was falling asleep. That was a surprise. They actually didn't do any damage to me. So it's just this like weird little hoarder boss fight. And he just, like, bails every single time. He doesn't do too much damage, so it seems like it's... It, it really is just, like, track him down and just wail on him. Because, yeah, he can't hurt me that bad. So when he's doing that, I just... Take it as easy opportunity to damage.
Yeah, he just drops a simple key. Is that it? Is that all this guy is? Just a simple key? Why? Is there anything else around here? Doesn't look like there's anything here. See the floor, floor opened on the right. This is where I came from. So, really it's just that one area up above. Unless there's more. Nope. That was it. What? That it, that's it? That's it? That's everything? Rightio. Alright, bench up. And do we level? It's tempting. Let's let's just keep going crit chance. Because that's like one of my major damage dealing things. Three times damage? It's a fairly easy simple key. No, this is valid. Oh, I was going to buy quick soul. Damn it. Alright, whatever. We'll just... Remember next time. Talk to him. Welcome back, warrior. Make a contribution. You can enter the trial of the fool. Okay, so, yeah, I just spent all of my geo. Well, let's come back later. If I remember, I try the fool's kind of tough. I'm not actually sure if it's that tough for me right now, but still. Okay, that gives the necessary number of keys to get into Godmaster. Oh, gotcha. Well, where do we go? Because we can go back to the City of Tears. There's a little bit left in Deep Nest I haven't been into. Oh god, getting back there? Oh wait, no, that's a shortcut in into Deep Nest. I remember that. Yeah, I don't really know. Yeah, we should probably go for Shade Cloak more than anything else. So let's let's head for that. That's that's important. Can I get Shade Cloak before I get any of the Dreamers? Because if that's the case, that's awesome. Weep. Because, yeah, having the Shade Cloak means dashing. Or, well, dodging. Which I think we could kind of use. Let's see. Oh, right. I forgot this guy always spawns here. So it can be obtained after uh, after Hornet 2. Interesting. Yeah, because that was like one of the last things I did. Also got a Pale Ore. We should go see if I can turn it in for a, uh, a sword upgrade while we're here. Because yeah, we, we can just drop straight into the Ancient Basin. Yeah. That's a plan. I never do enough damage to kill these guys. They're not worth it. I should probably kill one of them at some point. Uh, nope. Oh, I forgot. I've got Dash Master. I should turn that off. Let's see. Because, yeah, I... Dash Master is kind of fun, but it's not that important. And supposedly it's got, like, a speed boost upgrade. I don't actually know if I'm actually that much faster. Hail upgrade's gonna cost you more than you have. I figured I might as well double check anyway. We might as well just murder people. You have Dash Master and Sprint Master. I think I've only got one out of one out of two. Yeah, I don't have Sprint Master yet. Because the two of those should be quick. Oh, that's the other thing I want to grab. Eh, we'll get that in a bit. Uh, because I want to go get the the fragile greed. Because if I could, uh, if I can actually get like, uh, geo on a like, like geo over time, that'll make uh this whole leveling thing faster. Probably completely unnecessary for what I'm doing, but 
Eh, it's worth a shot. Let's see, did we already rescue the, uh, the girl? Yeah, we did. I can... we should check if she's in her house. Okay. I don't think I have enough to get this. He probably wants two. Mm, how you to return? Bring me two pieces. Oh, okay, we only have one. And there's a Wanderer's Journal you can sell. I actually forgot. <clears throat> let's see. So yeah, let's go sell the Wanderer's Journal. Then let's go get Fragile Greed and see if we can get that combo. And the music for City of Tears is just so good. And there's actually multiple uh, multiple versions of it. I actually had forgotten about that. But like when you're out here, they add a lot more like bass. Is it bass? I'm not actually immediately sure. Oh, right. We're going to sell the Wanderer's Journal. That's back over here. Is this one? Yeah. What if you can actually like not break the elevator? Um, I wonder if the elevator can crush you. No. Treble. Okay. Oh wow, I've got a bunch of these. More sun? Water general, you have a knack for finding these corpses. Must be frequent on your journey. No doubt your nails created many more. Another wa wanderer's journal, eh? This journal is the traditional stone type, and text endures well on it. In its declining age, this city switched from stone to parchment woven of spider silk. It's a small tragedy, but the moisture in these towers has rendered most of these texts illegible. Wanderer's journal, have you heard that saying about stone journals? If da danger lurks close by, your nail is dulled with wear. Just swing your journal at your foes with blunt and deadly flair. It's a good one, isn't it? And accurate. They sure have a heft to them. What's that? A wanderer's journal? I have so many of these now. Once I get around to deciphering them all, I'll be the preeminent scholar in all of Hollow Nest's dead. Do you believe you found it can crush you in a previous playthrough? Probably. I've just forgotten. It was a long series and a long time ago. Another hollow nest seal. Others have told me there's a statue out there by the city's entrance depicting a large knightly figure. Could be one of the kingdom's great five. I'd have looked over it myself, but the gate's long been shut tight. It's too much hassle for taking the long way around with all those blasted husks about. Uh, okay. Okay, so now we've actually got a decent chunk of Geo. Uh, let's go buy Quick Focus and the other little perks. We buy. We. We. And unfortunately, I don't know if I want to dash here because I feel like I'm just going to run into something bad. Oh, well, doing it anyway. We. Maybe I can actually just. Bypass. Okay. So we want to go... Salubra? We want to go for Salubra. She'd actually be right up here. If I did it. I just realized there's a really useless tram there on the other side of the resting grounds. <laughs> I had completely forgotten about that. Uh, yeah, let's just go, let's just go to Salubra first. Quick focus is actually stupidly helpful. And so the sooner we get our hands on it, the better. And then we can look into everything else. Probably Fragile Greed? Yeah, 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 yeah. We want, we want Fragile Greed. Because if I, if I can just earn a small amount of Geo over time, I realize that that's going to, uh... 
I realize that's that's going to make this whole like leveling thing even more ridiculous, but it's kind of one of those where it's like I really want to see what happens when you're like grossly over leveled in this. I'm sure I've become like stupidly powerful, but there's something fun about that for me, especially in a game that I've already beaten before. I have gone the wrong direction. That said, I guess I needed to kill that guy for some reason. Help. Okay, so what do we do? Go up here, go to the left, punch the microphone. Hurts a little. It's a bit of a sharp microphone. Spore Shroom with Oon makes an aesthetic. Well, I mean, we could just jam them all on. Nope. Hi. I'm just going to do it from up here. Wee, bye. Ah, oh, shoot. Wee, bye. Ah, shoot. Don't mind me. Well, anyway, like I said, we've got infinite charm notches, so we can just try the Omni build, which is just literally everything. And again, realize that kind of offsets the whole challenge of everything, but still. Yeah, what a calm play place. It's action I want, vicious and deadly battle. This serenity is a bore. So peaceful, so dull. That place calls me. Somewhere beyond this lake, perhaps. I had actually forgotten about this guy. Man, he's slow. We've already done that. Oh, interesting. We have a 1% chance on that, to, on a kill, to just... Get essence. I actually didn't know that. Alright, Salubra. Lifeblood Heart, Steady Body, Shaman Stone, Quick Focus. I mean, honestly, should probably buy the lot of them while we're here. And we'll come back for the notches later. Okay, so... Plunks some things down. So for starters, let's get rid of Fury of the Fallen and Dash Master. Uh, let's see. Quick Focus plus Shape of Oon. Let's see. Just gonna do those. We... Whoa. I see what you mean. There is a combination there. It is, you go hella fast! Let's see, study body is amazing. Okay, uh, we can jam that on next. Ow. Or, wait, no. Study body is the one that I already have? No, that's stalwart shell. I don't think I have study body. Okay, so we want to head for the fungal waste on the other side of this. Please don't tell me we're doing San Sanic Night. Well, unfortunately, I can't actually stay in, in super speed bug form. Uh, sadly, because... Uh... Oh, wrong side. Sadly, we can't do super speed bug because effectively it, it, like, stops to do the heal animation. Now, if I could actually just, like, lightly press B and, like, transform into that to, like, zip around and block, that'd be hilarious. And I do it in a heartbeat because it'd be really, really fun. But no, that's not how this works, unfortunately. Yeah, so we're currently in the slow part of the series, which is namely the part where I'm I'm backtracking instead of actually doing progress. Because doing progress is a pain in the butt and it's going to make the enemies harder. And I'm lazy. We should actually, now that I'm thinking about it, yeah, we'll go we'll go over to the uh, flying mantis area. I'm going to see if I can do. I'm going to see if I can do the rest of the Trial of Fools. I'd like one more Pale Ore, uh, but if I can do the Trial of Fools before the difficulty up uptick, I think that'll actually save me a lot of trouble. And then we can go do the Three Dreamers, and then uh, we can do the Three Dreamers and then head towards beating the game. 
Uh, question. Can you actually do Godmaster before? Or do you have to beat the game before Godmaster? Because it would be really funny to just leave the Dreamers and everything uh, for the very, very end. Okay, you can do Godmaster before the ending. Do you have to kill the Dreamers first, though? Because if I remember right, the Dreamers actually scale the difficulty. And so if I can actually just, uh... I'm not going to say just bypass, but... If I can hold off, it might make things easier? I don't really know. Okay, I think this is the guy. I'll make more. They'll give me more Geo. If someone comes by, they'll have to give me their Geo. If you have enough Geo, you become a king. When I get enough Geo, I'll become a king. Okay, so we want Fragile Greed. See, do we have enough? We could go... Fragile Strength, I guess? Okay. So you can do Godmaster whenever you reach the post-dreamer state. Okay. So, wow. Okay, we just picked up a whole bunch. So we want to stick on Fragile Greed. There's Fragile Greed and... Gathering Swarm. Passively generates 1 to 25 Geo every 10 seconds. Alright, let's, um... Get out and watch. See if I just generate Geo. Yep. Alright. We are now broken. Okay, so we are in untrodden ground, which is fine. So, question is, we are here. We're looking for corner first somewhere around here. Ow. Ow? Not actually sure what all hit me there. Things. Things hit me. This place is weird. So Fragile Creed is obviously a bit of a... Oh! And that actually makes this a lot tougher. The orange eggs hurt like the dickens. Dude, I forgot about those. Okay, I can I can safely outrange them kind of not really. Okay. Hmm. Well, this... Man. I remember this part. Uh, let's see. I want to watch the Kingdom Hearts thing. I... Uh, God, I gotta figure it out. Um, I mean, really what I need to do is not have maintenance wake me up super early in the morning so I can actually start early. Because my problem is, uh, let's see, Soul Nail to get Soul, does not that work? Does that not work on these things? Doesn't look like it. I'm just gonna stand here and shoot, and hopefully I won't get blasted. But yeah, I'll, I'll try and do Kingdom Hearts tomorrow. I'd... Okay, there they go. It's one of those where it's like, imp oh, actually, that's good. That's good. No. Oh. And we get a charm notch. Oh, this is just this is just a little charm notch area. 
But yeah, my, my main problem is just I've been, um, strapped for time because I keep having, like, dumb emergencies. Like, you know, a couple of days ago, my apartment complex gassed me out of my own apartment. Uh, because of... Because of... I'm not gonna say shitty business practices, but their maintenance contractor... Wow! Damn, those things fly fast. Uh, their, their contractor, uh, who's handling the, uh... Who is, uh, their, their contractor who is repainting the apartment down below. More or less is just like, hey, let's, let's just not, uh, vent any of this and just more or less, uh, do it outside the air intake for my apartment. Which, uh, yeah, filled my apartment with fumes. Drained. And then... Yesterday I woke up to, uh... Yesterday or was it today, actually? Shit, I'm, I'm getting my, like, schedule messed up. What was yesterday? Well, I didn't sleep well yesterday, so... Friday I was, I was gassed out of my apartment. Saturday I didn't sleep well. Or, and Friday night to Saturday I didn't sleep well at all. Or is it Saturday? Shoot. My entire schedule is, is busted because of this. Uh, because I, I've lost all sense of time. Uh, oh! Cornifer's here. Or was here? I might have missed him. No, there he is. Okay, we're good. Oh, ho As odd as much of Hollowness can be, there's a whole new level of strangeness about these caves. Did you see that dark gate below? It's quite unsettling to be near. I did my best to avoid it. Fortunately for me, I found another route in. Although I did end up a little singed after wading through some acid. Purchase map of the area. Yes! See, is this a good area to have the fragile item on? Yes! So I'm going to keep that fragile item on for this uh, pretty much forever. I will have to repair it, but it, it, it pays for itself and then some. I'm making a, uh, a buttload of... Um... Oh, the Queen Station's all the way down there. Oh, oh, shoot, did I? I've missed some things. Let's, let's go back. Um, I'm making a buttload of Geo every 10 seconds from this guy. Uh, or this... This charm. Which, like, worth it. 